In this lesson, we want to learn how to delete the stored stuff in the CPU memory by means of the selector that we have here on this CPU. All right, let's get started. To do this, first off, we need to put the CPU in the stop mode. When we do this, as you can see, the stop LED comes on. After that, we bring the selector to the memory reset mode and we keep it in that mode up until the stop LED starts blinking. Next, we need to bring it to stop mode and then very quickly bring it back to the memory reset mode. In this case, as you can see, the stop LED starts blinking rapidly and this shows that the CPU memory has been successfully reset. Basically, we can reset its memory by switching the selector key on the CPU once or twice. But I should mention that when we reset the memory with this selector, the only things that get deleted are the memory variable values, not all the entire memory. So what should we do in order to delete the whole memory? To delete the full memory, we need to get online by using Step 7 software with PLC meaning that we need to connect the PLC with a computer and then select the blocks that are inside the CPU and by pressing delete on the keyboard we can delete all the stored stuff on the memory. This is what we're going to talk about in full detail in the future lessons. Okay, so in this lesson we've learned to reset the CPU memory by using the selector key.